before we get started in this video, um, just make sure you use code rounds if this actually helps you and stuff like that. Code rounds. I'm probably gonna get changed later, but yeah, thank you. Alright, what is up, guys? It's your boy Rounds here, bringing you a video on how to um get 144 hertz on your 144 hertz monitor on an HDMI. A lot of people say you can't do it on an HDMI, but it is possible, and I'll show you how to do it right now. And then I've seen a whole bunch of videos and nothing helped me at all so I'm like every time I open up Fortnite it'll do it'll do screen sharing and stuff like that but in this video I'll show you how to do it so basically what you want to do is um identify what well I have a dual monitor set up but for example this hurt this monitor pulls um 144 hertz but what you want to do is go to advanced settings and it usually say 60 hertz if there's caps are 60 hertz go to display adapter and then this is where the settings are at I don't have the best um, graphics card, but this is what it is. List all modes, and then whichever one fits the one that like that looks good for you and stuff like that. So whatever your settings you want to use here. So for example, but make sure it's like 100 and above. For this one, this is the best settings for me, and it looks doesn't look as blurry, but it looks fine. So this is what I use: 1750 by 1080. Click OK. Click Apply, and if it doesn't look fuzzy and stuff like that, find the best setting for you, of course. But make sure it's like it pulls a hundred more if you want to pull more than 100 hertz. So choose the one, for example, minus 120 hertz, but I'm gonna cap it at 120 hertz. Click apply, click OK, and this should save, so it shouldn't change at all. So, what you need to know is this our resolution is 1750 by 1080 because it's very important. Because when we go to NVIDIA control panel, right click it, and we're gonna open this up. You're gonna click as you can see, it's HDMI, but you want to click customize create custom resolution and then for example whatever that was the one that fit right here whichever this one was you want to put it to this 750 by 1080 as you can see in the refresh rate 120 don't mess with anything else click test and then it should see if it works and if it it doesn't show a black screen then it's fine but make sure everything's fine so you click test okay apply and then you want to click from right here apply okay and then make sure this is 120 Hertz after that you should be fine with all the settings so you shouldn't mess with anything else right, what you want to do is come down here click percent local app data percent right here percent local app data percent open up she'll bring you up to this go to a fortnite game saved config windows client game users settings click um right click and click properties turn off read only and then you should open it up and what I showed you back there which was um my display settings for example this one was 1750 by 1080 1750 by 1080 so make sure you change it from here 1750 by 1080 go to your um notepad whatever it opened up and then you should go down to desired screen width blah 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 last year settings change it to that so native is 1950 by 1080 but change it to whatever res it was so whatever res this was showing Where's it at? whatever the res this was showing so 1750 by 1080 is mine 1750 by 1080 bam bam change them all 1750 by 1080 these are the only two ones that show this one and this one then you want to come down here oh no it's not down here it's um right here this is usually a negative, but if it's not, then it's fine. Don't just mess, don't mess with anything else. But this, if it's a negative, change to zero, 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 and it's fine. Then click file, and then click save. Once you click save, exit out. Then you want to go back to the, and then click right click it and click properties. And click read only. Make sure it's on read only. And after that, you should be set, and then you should get how many hertz you want, or as it's pulling as many hertz as it's pulling it should show if you have any questions leave them down below if you have any struggles and stuff like that will be answered to all of you because my channel is not big and yeah yeah so that's pretty much it make sure you like sub and do all that good stuff it did hope all right